And we're back. Several Missouri hikers woke up before sunrise Saturday, laced up their tennis shoes and hiking boots, and set off to hike part of the Ozark Trail in Iron County. Hale Yates Bailey Harvard explains why so many people went. This is Kevin Harmon. He spent almost nine hours hiking 30.1 miles of the Ozark Trail. The first one to cross the finish line. He shaved almost 50 minutes off his time from last year. Hiking 30.1 miles might seem crazy to you and me, but for those hiking the Ozark Trail today, the trek had a special meaning. I am hiking for Maddie Reynolds. She's one of my clients. She is a 19-year-old young woman who um, has CF, and because of CF, she's middle-aged. Um, and that's really frustrating for me. And I also hike for Mike Burke, who has outlived his disease so far. Harmon and 54 other hikers took part in the third annual Extreme Hike. The hike aims to raise money and awareness for those suffering from cystic fibrosis. Cystic fibrosis causes normally thin bodily fluids like mucus, sweat, and digestive juices to be thick and sticky. At the time of the event, the hikers had managed to raise over $162,000. Harmon says he and the other hikers had ways to keep them moving towards the finish line. I don't know, singing songs, just trying to not think about hiking 30 miles. Whatever we can do to not think about our knees hurting or our ankles hurting or our shins hurting from going downhill or uphill. The event's coordinator says it's been rewarding to watch the hikers in action. They enjoy the camaraderie. You know, it's really neat to see how this group has become a really tight bunch. They've been training together, um, and they've really gotten to know each other well. And so that's really rewarding to see that, too. Hiking 30.1 miles is daunting, but finishing the hike and raising money for the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation can be considered a wonderful reward. But there are some other perks. They've got massages for us and a hot tub back at the lodge, so I'm ready to take advantage of that. Bailey Harbit, KOMU8 Sports, Iron County.